Hello everyone, welcome to Tarot So Fine, and today I'm doing a what, what Aries needs to know. This applies for whenever you view the video, uh, or whenever you want to watch it, you'll know how it fits in. This applies to your sun, moon, rising, and Venus sign. Um, I'm using the uh, Spiral Tarot for this reading, so... Let me know if you like the images and would like me to do a flip through of the deck. I might do that in the future. So um, let's see what we have for the sign of Aries. Fire signs. This applies to cross watchers too. If you're a cross watcher, this, you know, you can flip it one way or the other, whatever comes through. So let's see. Aries. What does Aries need to know? Your cards are very uh, difficult, is how I would put it. Difficult. Okay. One more. Okay, here we go. Seven of Swords. Ace of Cups. Eight of Swords. Yeah. Restrictions. Something's not right. I felt it. Princess of Wands. Which is Page of Cups. A uh, Page of Wands. And the bottom card. Whew. Ten of Swords. Difficult energy. Hmm. What's going on, Aries? Hmm. No major arcanas, but... Heavy duty cards with uh, seven, eight, and ten of swords. Difficult. I almost feel angry, you know, I don't know why. You're, uh, as soon as I started shuffling your cards, I felt anger, difficulty, and like rebelliousness that's what I felt so let me have a look at your cards here Something is definitely not right. Whatever is going on with you or around you. Um, it's crazy. Um, I feel like... Underneath the Ten of Swords... Is the is the uh, the Queen of Wands? I get a feeling in the spread with the Queen of Wands here underneath the Ten of Swords, is and the Eight of Swords. Ugh. Okay, I've got so much. Okay, I'll just tell you what I'm feeling with this spread here. Someone is feeling very restricted by, it could be someone of influence in your environment. Now, you can flip this the other way around. This could be you doing this or something you're dealing with. I feel like there is a, um, 
an energy of someone wanting to impose their will on you and you have all of these all of this creativity within you um, you have all of these creative ideas and passions and aspirations things you want to do and this could also refer to uh, your childhood if you're older now like this could refer to something that has been happening for a long time because you see this um, princess of wands here there's this playful dragon it's very I don't know it's the dragon to me represents the queen of wands in the spread it's as though you're full of these creative ideas but you're not able to explore them like there's this person controlling you a very controlling person around you so it makes you feel stuck like you can't express yourself you can't you can't um, like you find it hard to find happiness to, new happiness in your life your bliss you know it's as though you've been cheated out of with the seven of swords can be the thief card it's as though you've been cheated out of potential new beginnings in love for some of you um, or your creative um, urges you know you can't be yourself you just can't be yourself and then we have this ten of swords it's like you've had enough here some maybe something happened or something was said for the uh, hundredth time you know and um, it's like the straw that broke the camel's back now you're rebellious now you want to you've reached your limit with this control thing and now you want to break free and you will break free if you see here she doesn't feel like she can she's surrounded by these swords and she feels unable to do anything or to say anything because swords are your words your thoughts and actions so here I see this person from the eight of swords struggling to remove these swords it's caused you a lot of pain a lot of damage after the ten there is no more but that's the worst as that's the worst it can get so whoever is causing this kind of pain they can't they've done everything now they can't hurt you any more than they have so it's time to it's time now to free yourself it's time to free yourself it's time to escape from this torture here well because you're ready you're ready to find emotional fulfillment because I it to me I, as I read this I feel like you haven't had any It's always been about this other person here, what they wanted. Very controlling. I don't normally see the Queen of Wands like that, but yeah. I think this person, whoever it is, can be very nasty if they don't get things the way they want them, the way they, they think they, sh they should turn out. 
they can get very nasty if you don't go by their rules the way they think you should be. They feel like they can mold you into whatever they want you to be. I see that because it's like she's holding something here. It's like you're their pet project. And if you go, if you break out of that framework, then they can get very nasty with you. Oh my gosh, that's horrible. Wow, I hope... I hope this reading doesn't apply to you. It's it's very bad. But the good thing is that with the Ten of Swords, if you're in this state here where you've been wounded, like really wounded, know that from here on, it only gets better. Because we have the sun on the horizon here. You're in a dark place, but there's the sun. So... The important thing is to remove yourself from this kind of situation because you can have this Ace of Cups here. You can have this emotional fulfillment start once you walk away, once you walk away from this madness here. So that's heavy duty. I hope you, uh, you got something out of that. And uh, let me know what's going on. Leave me your comment. Like, share, subscribe, and we'll see you for the following read. Bye for now.